And <clears throat> uh, I, I'm going to tell you, Syria is, it is one of the most incredibly wonderful nations on earth. And uh, the fact that America set out to topple the government and destroy it long before there was this, the faintest hint of civil unrest uh, is just, it, it's really one of the, one of the great uh, uh, stains on American honor. Uh, meet with the refugees and people like that. You, it turns black and white into technicolor. Right. And uh, <clears throat> I, I'm going to tell you, Syria is, it is one of the most incredibly wonderful nations on earth. And uh, the fact that America set out to topple the government and destroy it long before there was this, the faintest hint of civil unrest uh, is just, it, it's really one of the, one of the great uh, uh, stains on American honor. Kate, did you hear what he just said, this is a senator of the United States who went to Syria and studied the situation and, in his own words, talked with people on the ground. Listen again. ...ground and, and shake hands with the soldiers and, uh, and uh, meet with the refugees and people like that. You. It turns black and white into technicolor. Right. And uh, <clears throat> I, I'm going to tell you, Syria is, it is one of the most incredibly wonderful nations on earth. And uh, the fact that America set out to topple the government and destroy it long before there was this, the faintest hint of civil unrest uh, is just, it, it's really one of the, one of the great uh, uh, stains on American honor. And I want you guys to listen to that. Okay? Christians, Christians, listen to what he is saying. It's a stain on American honor. And how much more is it a stain on Christians that would so willingly support and be duped into supporting, willingly being duped into supporting the killing of the people that are protecting your brothers and sisters. And you just need to have a memory longer than a goldfish. That's it. And you need to think about what you're supporting and what we are supporting as Americans with our taxes and with our labor and our blood and our sweat and our tears and what are we leaving for our children? What are we leaving for our children? Come on. Come on. We can't be supporting and be, we cannot be duped so easily. We cannot be duped so easily, Christians that want the truth. You can't be duped. Just think about it and do a simple search. <clears throat>